All right, today we are going to talk about parking your cars perfectly in your garage every time without having anything hanging from the ceiling or sitting on the floor. It'll be perfectly on the ceiling, out of the way. Next. All right, so what we have here is a park right garage laser park and what happens is this silver part goes on the ceiling and it plugs into an outlet at the top these two lasers point down you adjust the lasers to be perfectly where you want to park that way when you drive in it senses the motion of the car and um, you can easily park in the right spot every time so we're going to go ahead and get this installed on the ceiling and show you how it works. All right, so this is what comes in the box. Um, this is actually the lasers here and they are completely adjustable, any angle. This is the motion sensor and in the bottom um, you can actually put in some backup batteries. I'm not going to do that. We rarely lose power um, and you know how batteries get when they get low start leaking so we're going to leave that empty and then this base here attaches to the bottom and this gets mounted to the ceiling and we have some screws a warning sticker and a power all right so and of course our instructions let's get that installed all right so now we are going to install the plate that goes on the ceiling that the laser box slides into. So let's go ahead and get that installed now. We're just gonna screw it to the ceiling with the provided screws. Okay, we had a little bit of trouble with the small screws that came with the set because they were very small. And when it went into the drywall, it just went in and didn't hold anything. So what we did is we put in these drywall anchors and this one is actually going into a stud. So that will be screwed in to the actual wood. here so you want to put that up like this there we go slide right into place and do not point the lasers in your eyes of course All right, that's good and sturdy on there it's not going to go anywhere. All right, now we need to connect the power. So this is the power cord that came with it here. So I'm going to plug that in it's on this side. Just plug it into the side. And let's see. the laser on my hand here
that'll be good enough for now. All right, now we're gonna get our cars, pull them into the exact spots that we want them to be in and adjust our laser so it points in the spot that we'll be able to recognize when we drive our cars in. Shut your garage door, make sure you have just enough space for the door to shut, plus a little extra. We probably have about six inches before the car would actually hit the actual garage door right there. And try and point the laser in a spot where we would easily be able to see. There. So I'm thinking probably right here in the middle of the dash would be perfect. So let's go ahead and put it there. I'm just going to get it right in the middle on the front there. That should be nice and easy to see when we drive in. Alright, perfect. And now we'll just do the same with the other car. All right, so this is what it looks like at the end. We got both of our lasers perfectly calibrated for each car. And we use the little ledge um, right at the opening there. Same thing over here, right at the edge of the dash. So when we pull in, we just need to be right at the edge of the dash. And what we did is um, we plugged it into this plug here, which was a little tighter fit and we zip tied the power cord around it and we also zip tied the excess of the power cord back to this bracket coming down. That way if anything were to fall it would still be hanging up here and not damage any cars. So now we are going to drive into the garage and perfectly park effortlessly. Here comes the laser, right up to the edge. And now we know we are perfectly parked. And that's how it works, super easy. I hope you guys found this video helpful. As you can see, both of our cars are parked perfectly and we won't have to do anything from now on. Um, it's very easy to install. And if you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And also I've left everything down in the video description of everything that you'll need to get this done, um, including this uh, magnetic bracelet here. Very nice to put screws on while you're working, drill bits, whatever. Um, but thanks for watching.